Born in Venezuela, Professor Rafael Reif is the 17th president of Massachusetts Institute of Technology and a man of vision. A distinguished academic who served previously as MIT's provost, he fostered the important cooperation between MIT and Israeli universities. As president, he is a steadfast supporter of Israeli academia on the global stage. In 2012, he chaired the International Review Committee for the Technion Viterbi Faculty of Electrical Engineering and was instrumental in establishing the MIT Technion Postdoctoral Fellowships Program, a collaboration that benefits both institutes. Raphael is a champion of investment in basic science while pursuing MIT's signature program to promote innovation and entrepreneurship. Pioneering the future of higher education, Rafael is a leader in the development of MIT's online learning programs that are an educational triumph. In March 2017, the MIT Open Online Learning Platform edX had more than 11 million unique learners. He has 13 patents and has edited or co-edited five books. Rafael is an elected member of the National Academy of Engineering and the American Academy of Arts and Science. Technion and MIT are very unique institutions and they are very similar in many ways. They are both focused on science and technology. They are both trying to advance the state of the art in science and technology. They both are trying to use technology to do great things. So they're pretty much kindred spirits. And I think the more we can do together, the more we can benefit from each other, the more we help make the world a better place. So I think this is something that I've been always looking forward to and trying to expand which is more interaction between the Technion and MIT. I am humbled and honored and extremely excited by receiving an honorary degree from the Technion. Growing up in my home country in Venezuela, I always admired institutions like the Technion and MIT. I saw them as very unique places in which the very best of the best want to go and advance uh, science and technology to advance humanity. So I have admired those institutions for so long. And I'm now in a very unique position of having the tremendous privilege of running one of those institutions, which is to me a huge honor in itself. And, and now I have the opportunity to receive an honorary degree from the other institution that I have admired. I don't think I can dream for bigger accomplishment in life right now for me. So it means a great deal to me to be honored in this way by the technical.